VC News, Akure. And turning our attention now to the southeast, where Enugu State Government has announced a ban of illegal tax collection, the cancellation of illegal revenue contracts. This was made public at a news conference in Enugu to curb incessant harassment and extortion. Kwame Diliajai reports. The growing concerns of multiple tax collection and harassment of holiday travelers traveling from north to south have been attributed to increasing prices of goods and services in the southeast region. Spot on numbers of men mounting checkpoints on the highways for illegal revenue collections, extortion of motorists by personnel masquerading as government revenue collectors. To address this issue of increasing multiple tax system, touting an illegal collection of levies, hence government resolved to ban their operations and cancel illegal revenue contracts in the state. The state government orders them to steer clear of the road to stem their excesses in the state. In order to stem these excesses and ensure a free movement of persons, goods and services, as well as improved logistics and supply chain operations in Enugu State, the Enugu State government hereby orders such extortionists to clear off our roads as anyone caught engaging in such activities henceforth will be arrested and made to face the full wrath of the law. Local government authorities and traditional institutions are advised to comply with the order to ensure illegal revenue collections are contained. But today, government has taken positions and uh, the traditional rulers of uh, Enugu State will comply with positions of the government to make sure that uh, the touting is no longer within our area. The activities of the touts along the roads has hampered our businesses in so many ways. The state government also announced the establishment of service centers to serve as a central hub, tailored to meet the needs of logistics and businesses. The services will include the provision of livestock health and agro-produce diagnostic centers to ensure that animals and food coming into the state are safe for consumption. Second, provision of designated points where security officials can check and ensure that arms and other dangerous goods are not imported into the state. The state government is collaborating with various agencies and stakeholders to ensure sanity and restore investors' confidence in the state. Bamidili Ajayi, TVC News, Enugu.